This video will address how to properly adjust the low flow bypass on a Watts automatic control valve. This video is not intended to replace published installation instructions or the experience of a trained product installer. Please refer to the startup instructions for further information and product warnings. Consult local codes before beginning any work. The low flow bypass is used in applications where the system can see wide demands in usage, like a hotel. During the day, high water usage from bathrooms, laundry rooms, and kitchens means the ACV can supply demand without issue. However, during low demand periods, the valve can either satisfy demand so quickly that it may chatter, which is rapidly opening and closing, eventually leading to wire draw, or not respond at all. That's where the low flow bypass comes into play. The bypass will sense the small demand downstream and open to supply water without ever requiring the main valve to modulate. The low flow bypass includes inlet and outlet pressure gauges, inlet and outlet shutoffs, and an LF223 direct acting pressure reducing valve. Begin by ensuring the low flow bypass shutoffs are open and the pilot system shutoffs are closed. We'll set the bypass pressure 5 to 10 PSI higher than the pilot pressure to ensure the bypass senses the downstream pressure drop before the main valve. The pilot is set to 55 PSI, so we'll set the bypass to 60 PSI. Bypass adjustments should be made under flow. Create a flow condition downstream by either opening a faucet or a valve. Turn the adjusting screw to adjust the pressure clockwise to increase the set point, counterclockwise to lower, until you've reached the desired set point, indicated by the outlet pressure gauge. Once you've reached the desired set point, close the flow condition and observe the gauge. Under a no-flow condition, the downstream pressure may rise past the targeted set point. This is known as lockup pressure and is normal when adjusting pressure reducing valves. Make any final adjustments to the bypass to meet your target pressure. Open the shutoffs on your pilot system and ensure the system is holding pressure. To learn more about troubleshooting your ACV, head to watts.com.